Well, a rainy and windy day in Southern California as we welcome you to game day and get you set tonight for the Flames and Ducks. It's back to back games in California for the Flames. L.A. last night, tonight it is Anaheim as they continue their season series, the third of four head to head meetings this season. And for the Calgary Flames, of course, looking to bounce back after a lopsided loss last night. Let's talk about the opposition, though, here briefly. They're in the middle of a eight game homestand right now and for the Ducks. Kind of playing for next year at this point in their season. They sit seventh place in the Pacific Division, well out of the playoff picture. They have two wins in their past seven games, but are coming off a victory over the Calgary Flames in the last head-to-head -head meeting. As for the Flames, what well, we know last night was not exactly what they had in mind against the Los Angeles Kings falling in that hockey game, but the good news for them is an opportunity to bounce back. They've been very good on the road here over the last couple of weeks, and they'll look to get right back to that type of game tonight against the Ducks and the other good news that comes with it they're back on the ice here but still remain just four points back of that final playoff spot in the Western Conference the out-of-town scoreboard will be busy once again here tonight but the Flames only focused on taking care of themselves individually yeah I mean, it, was a, it was a bit of a shock obviously it's uh nobody's happy nobody is uh feeling like they played a good game last night so you know it's really on the individuals I think uh you can say what you want as a team but at the end of the day, you gotta <clears throat> you gotta look in the mirror and and you gotta you know be happy with yourself and the way that you performed. And uh, I know I'm not happy with with my game, and I know I'll be a lot better tonight. And uh, you know I'm hoping that uh, every guy in this team will, will say the same. Time now for a look at who to watch, and we'll start with the Ducks and one of their young star forwards, Troy Terry, coming off a career year last year. His numbers slightly down this season, but hit the 20 goal mark this past weekend for the second consecutive time. He's got five points in his last four games and sits second overall on the Ducks in scoring. And for the Calgary Flames, one of their most consistent defenders, Noah Hannafin, continues to log the biggest minutes of his career, over 22 and a half per night, and has quietly put together a five-game point streak, including his sixth goal of the season. That happened uh, in the third period last night against the Los Angeles Kings. As far as the lineup is concerned, uh, team didn't go to the rink here this morning, so we'll wait until warm-up to find out if there are any lineup changes. We'll also await the starting goaltender. Uh, of course, Dan Vladar came in, played the third period last night in L.A. Head coach Gerald Sutter said after the game that he has a couple of options, obviously, given the fact that he got Vladar some work. Uh, Markstrom has started the last 10 straight games for the Calgary Flames. Ducks and Flames to wrap up this road trip tonight.